Why did you ask me and Michael to come if you're going to be a dickhead? Just calm down, okay? Welcome to the Mysterious Accent channel. Angela is going to talk to Michael's friends and it looks like it's going to be a very healthy conversation. This whole situation, it's got my skin crawling. This is just so fucking weird. Like, really weird, Michael. Angela thinks this is weird because she doesn't understand why Michael's friends are talking to Michael. Because Angela doesn't allow Michael to talk to his friends. You know how it is, Angela doesn't allow poor Michael to do anything. But Michael has been secretly talking to them. And baby, how did they even know I was in Nigeria? You had to call them or something? No, no. Somebody told them they ain't psychic now, hell. The goofballs that you said that you don't have any relations with no more. It's just... No, they're it, always it, against this marriage from the beginning. Angela might be crazy, but she's definitely not stupid. She knows that Michael has been talking to them behind her back. I don't think it's wise for Michael to lie to her like this, because this is gonna make her angry, and when she gets angry, she does some crazy things. I haven't seen his friends in five years. I hate that Michael's been seeing the goofballs behind my back, because... The goop balls have been nothing but disrespectful to me and been bad influences on Michael. Angela is not angry yet, but she is slowly getting triggered. However, Michael is confident that everything is gonna be okay. They, they don't want you to be with me, Michael. If they didn't like you, I mean, why would they invite both of us out? I don't know what kind of drugs Michael is on, but there is no way this is gonna end up well, because Michael's friends are definitely against his relationship with Angela. I and Angela, we had fights, and uh, we broke up. Whoa, finally. Wow. For the first time, you stood up at the mark. I guess any real friend would be against it. So, they are probably real friends. But even though Michael is aware that his friends don't like Angela, Michael wants to make peace with everyone. I see their nasty asses. Well, we're off to a good start. I can already tell that hell is gonna break loose. So it was probably a bad idea for them, but it's probably gonna be entertaining for us watching. Angela, you look real good. I know. It's nice. I am pretty sure that he's just saying this to be polite. I mean, according to a lot of people, she looks like a turkey, so yeah. First of all, how did you know I was in Nigeria? Everybody knew something happened. It's, I don't know, it's a fucking talk of the, the old neighborhood. Like, um, a, a, a white lady came around to create a big scene. And my kind of scene. Like a huge scene. Definitely, we knew Angela was in town. Yeah, it makes sense, because I'm pretty sure that this is not something that happens every day in Nigeria. You know, a crazy turkey lady destroying a car while a professional film crew is recording everything is definitely the kind of gossip that spreads very quickly. Well, I think that's ridiculous. She doesn't believe them because she was expecting them to say that Michael was the one that told them. I guess she's trying to find an excuse to fight Michael. And I can see in her eyes that she's getting more and more triggered. I wonder how long it's gonna take for her to explode. I don't think it's gonna take very long. The incident with Angela, it's kind of funny because well, that's Angela who know. She makes trouble. Everywhere she goes to, she makes trouble. trouble. Oh, we invited Michael and Angela out because they shut down his Instagram account. So I think she still wants to be the boss and she still wants things to go her own way. Michael, I think you should just stand his ground now. I don't think Angela is supposed to tell Michael what to do. What's wrong? They are worried about Michael because they know Angela is extremely controlling and I think they can talk about it in front of her without any kind of problem. But if they talk about the Instagram account, Angela is definitely gonna explode. Because I think Michael's Instagram account is what triggers her the most. Mike, where have you been on Instagram? I thought you really want to be a social media influencer. Wrong move. He talked about the Instagram account and he talked about it with his marked smile on his face. Now Angela is gonna get triggered. Now she's gonna get angry. Do you know we was on the verge of divorce? He was flirting with women. Y'all knew it was gonna cause a major fucking drama between him and me. You're crazy. 
I gotta be honest, she's angry, but she's not as angry as I thought she would be. But if he keeps doing this spark smile, I don't think she's gonna be able to control her emotions for a very long time. No, no, no. If you're my husband's friend, and if y'all really had respect for, for our marriage, you would have said, Michael, do you understand the consequences? Are you ready for this fight with her? Are you possibly ready to get divorced? Y'all didn't do that. We want the best for Michael. He's our friend. For Michael. If Michael ever goes to the United States, he's never gonna see his friends again. Because Michael is gonna be under surveillance 24 hours a day. Without social media, he's not gonna be able to talk to his family. She's not gonna allow him to work. He's not gonna be able to do anything. Michael is gonna be like a bald Nigerian version of the Rapunzel. I'm not really sure Angela is the best option for you. Bro, what should we see? Okay, here we go. Now she's gonna explode. Actually, it took way longer than I thought it would. Why did you ask me and Michael to come if you're going to be a dickhead? Just calm down, okay? You need to calm down. You don't fucking tell me to calm down. You don't calm you down. fucking dare go there. You need to I'll calm down. I'll tip this motherfucking table over. You're not my husband. Don't you dare tell me to fucking calm you down. You need to dude. calm down. You better handle this motherfucker or I will. I'm his wife. You don't talk to me like that. Yeah, his wife, you need to calm I don't, down. Well, I'm not your fucking wife. I did. Hey, I'm not the one fucking you, so just calm did, down. Did you hear what he just said? You are a fucking pig. I'm getting ready to knock this motherfucker out. Okay, the guy is just trolling Angela to this point. By the way, this is a rare sight. She's not fighting Michael. I think it's the first time that it has happened this season. Can't you talk to your wife to calm down? No, you don't have to talk like that. Calm down. Why are you doing this? Are you something wrong with you? Calm down, now. Michael is actually defending Angela. I can't say I'm surprised because I think his friend kind of crossed the line. However, I gotta admit, it's kind of good to see someone treating Angela the same way she treats Michael, you know? Being disrespectful and rude for absolutely no reason. Y'all ever wanted to repair this relationship? You fucking didn't do it now. Angela. No. I ain't fucking you, bitch. You couldn't fuck this with a oh, million bucks. Angela, this is only You're nasty, this. you're foul, no, and you're not worth the shit. We're done here. Bro. Stay away Peace from me. your house. Whoa. She's the villain. Yeah, she's really yeah, the villain. I am. And bitch, I'm the boss. Shut the fuck up. And I'm the you boss. know what you're saying. And I'm the boss. It's okay, it's okay. It's and okay. I'm the boss. See us, bitch? We're walking. I'm the boss. It's okay. That's your friends. It's okay. She has a problem. Yeah, she definitely has a problem, but Michael's friend was trolling Angela hard. So it's not a surprise that she reacted the way she did. Honestly, I thought it would be way worse when compared to the things she did in the past. I think we can say that Angela was actually very calm. I can't just let a lady talk to me like that. It's crazy. Michael is just too calm for her. I don't think Michael is happy because he, he loves being on Instagram. I think she's just trying to oppress Michael. I just hope she's nicer nice, to uh, Michael when Michael gets to the United States. Yeah, Michael is definitely not happy and he's gonna be even more unhappy when he arrives in the US. But that's the price he gotta pay for his green card. This has gotta be the most expensive green card ever. Sorry honey, but I, 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 I'm shaking. They invited us to, to start you know, saying exactly. all sorts of things to they my wife. On she, my you head. are my wife, okay, now, especially Adi, running his mouth like, 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 like a I'm pig you did protect me brother and I thank you for that. It's okay, because you are I my wife now. Who am I supposed to protect? If not, for, if not you. Even though they are fine right now, their peace doesn't last very long. On the preview of the next episode, it looks like she's gonna find something to fight with Michael again. And she's probably gonna use it as an excuse to go to Canada and see Billy. This right here Michael did was all behind my back. I don't want to believe it, but I, there's, no way to, there's no way to defend it. I don't know how Angela is able to cry so much without dropping a single tear, so I have to add tears to her face. My name is Mysterious Accent. If you enjoy my content or if you want to see the end of the story, consider subscribing to my channel because I'm gonna do videos like this about the full story. That's it for today, see you in the next video.